What's up, sports bettors? We got last minute bets between the Heat and the Celtics to lock in. You guys are going to watch it. You're going to want to have some skin in the game. I got three bets for you guys to hammer for this game tonight. Let's get into it. Two plays I found using the odd stand positive EV page. The last play I found using the low holds page. All three of these bets are mathematically profitable, something that should make you money in the long run. Play number one. We're looking at Kevin Love to go over one and a half assists. This is at plus 155 odds at Bet Rivers. So when it comes to positive expected value betting, all you're doing is you're placing bets that you know as the sports better is going to hit at a higher rate than the reflected odds that the sports book is offering. Now, I, I understand that sounds like a mouthful, but when you dig into it, Really what it, how it works is Odds Jam pulls these no big odds that you see here. In this specific case, are priced at plus 145. So these odds are pulled from the sharpest sports books in the world, the sports books that consistently do the best job at pricing odds. You can view them as the true line of a market, the most accurate representation of what this market should be priced at, which in this case, again, we're looking at player assists for Kevin Love. So when I go back to the definition, Placing bets that we know as the sports better are going to hit at a higher rate than the reflected odds that the book is offering. This is how we know through these no big odds here. Odds Jam does all the work for us. They say, okay, these sports books consistently do the best job at price, pricing odds. So let's use them to set the market. And then we can get this bet all the way up at plus 155. So in this case, there's a 10 cent gap between these two numbers, right? Between the Odds Jam no big odds in the odds that bet rivers is giving it to us that's good that is the definition of a profitable bet but i don't just blindly hammer every single bet that i find on the ev page while yes they are all mathematically profitable what i like to do and what i recommend anybody using the ev page to do is to look into the markets themselves and see where all the books are pricing it you want to make sure that the odds of the bet you're placing are truly an outlier compared to the rest of the sports books. So in this case, plus 155. Well, let's see where every other book prices it. The closest book is 20 cents lower at plus 135. Then every other book is pretty much in the plus 120s with Bet365 at plus 130. So yeah, this plus 155 is awesome. It's a really good price, which is why I like it, which is why I recommend hammering it. So this is play number one, uh, Kevin Love over one and a half assists plus 155 odds at bet rivers next up the next play i found on the ev page we we're looking at Derek white to go over eight and a half points minus 110 odds at bet mgm so for this one the gap is a little bit closer together right we see the odds jam perfect line at minus 112 we see bet mgm at minus 110 so it's a little bit like i said closer together but it's still a good play it still has a true line of minus 112 and we're still getting it for better odds and similar to the previous one pretty awesome outlier at bet mgm so caesars is the one book that's kind of close at minus 115. every other book we see a couple at minus 125 and then from there minus 143 minus 143 minus 138 minus 130 and then we can ignore uh underdog and price picks because they're dfs companies so nothing really to glean from there um so this this Derek white one is in fact a good play. Derek White over eight and a half points as our second play for this video. And then the last one that we went ahead and locked in is Bam out of bio over eight and a half rebounds. So again, I found this play on the low holds page. There are plenty of different uh, tools you can use on OddsJam to find profitable bets. Positive EV1 is gonna be the best, but I use the arbitrage Traj tool and I use the low holds tool as well. You just need to do a little bit more digging when you're using these tools. Like we see uh, FanDuel price this at minus 128. It's the same thing. Just look at where every other book prices it. The closest book is 17 cents higher at minus 145. And there's three of them. And then above them are all in the minus 150s. Minus 151, minus 150, minus 153, and up to minus 162. So this BAM out of bio over eight and a half rebounds, admittedly, a little bit more juice than what we like at minus 128 still a really good price so this is my third and final pick for this video last minute bets to lock in for heat celtics tonight if you're tailing comment and let me know 
Other than that, remember to like the video, subscribe to the IGM YouTube channel, hit me up at my Twitter handle that I've been circling around right here. Thanks for watching and have a good one. All right, everybody, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video. Below are all of my different social medias where I post picks and plays daily. Make sure to hit me up there. Also, make sure to subscribe to the YouTube channel as I'm constantly putting out new videos to learn how to make money sports betting. And that's it. So thanks for watching and have a good one.